welcome. Today we'll go through JMC 2015 problems 1 to 10. Which of the following calculations gives the largest answer? In turn, A is 6, B is 4, C is 2, D is minus 4, and E is 0. So A is the largest. It has just turned 22 past 10. How many minutes are there until midnight? Well, 60 minus 22 is 38. So there are 38 minutes until 11 and a further 60 minutes to midnight. 38 plus 60 is 98. So there are 90 min 98 minutes until midnight. And so the answer is E. What is the value of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 divided by 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5? So we are asked to find 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 divided by 15. Of course, we can divide the number by 15. Or we can have a look at the options we are given. And we can see that 1 and 8 are clearly too small. And 1, 2, 3, 5, 9 is clearly too big. So it's either 678 or 823. Now, 800, uh, 678 multiplied by 15 ends in a zero uh, because 8 multiplied by 5 ends in a zero. And 823 multiplied by 15 ends in a 5 because 3 multiplied by 5 ends in a 5. But because 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 ends in a 5, the answer cannot be 678 because that multiplied by 15 would end in a zero. So it must be 823. In this partly completed pyramid, each rectangle is to be filled with the sum of the two numbers in the rectangles immediately below it. What number should replace x? So here we're just going to fill in um, the values of the rectangles. So we'll start with 13 minus 9 gives 4, 105 minus 47 gives 58, 58 minus 31 gives 27, 47 minus 27 gives 20, 20 minus 13 gives 7, and 7 minus 4 gives 3, so x is 3. The difference between a third of a certain number and a quarter of the same number is 3. What is the number? So let this number be x. Then a third of this number, a third of x, minus a quarter of this number, a quarter x, is equal to 3. Now the rule with equations is you can do whatever you like with them, but you have to do the same thing to both sides. So here, we want to get rid of the fractions, and we can do this by multiplying both sides by 12. And we reach 4x minus 3x is 36. We simplify this to x is 36, and so 36 is our number. What is the value of x in the triangle? Well, we know that angles in a triangle sum to 180 and the total of the angles on a straight line sum to 180. So we can find all three angles of the triangle. We first find 180 minus 110 is 70. 180 minus 120 is 60 here. And so x is 180 minus 130 which is 50. The result of the calculation 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 multiplied by 8 is almost the same as 
9875432 except that two of the digits are in a different order. What is the sum of these two digits? Now we could multiply this large number by 8, but we can make a mistake here and it's tedious. Instead, we look for a trick. And so the units digit of this big number will be the same as the units digit of 9 times 8, which is 2. But if we look at the units digit of 9876543211, its units digit is 1. So those two digits must be the ones that were switched around. So 1 plus 2 is 3. Which of the following has the same remainder when it is divided by 2 as when it is divided by 3? So what could spring to mind is that if the remainder is 0, then it will be a multiple of 6. So it will be a multiple of both 2 and 3. If the remainder is 1, it will be 1 more than a multiple of 2 and 1 more than a multiple of 3. So maybe 1 more than a multiple of 6. And we can quickly see that 7 is 1 more than a multiple of 6. And 7 divided by 2 is 3 remainder 1. And 7 divided by 3 is 2 remainder 1. So 7 must be our answer. According to a newspaper report, a 63-year-old man has rode around the world without leaving his living room. He clocked up 25,048 miles on a rowing machine that he received for his 50th birthday. Roughly how many miles per year has he rowed since he was given the machine? So he has been rowing for 63 minus 50, which is 13 years. And if we look at all the answers in increasing order, they're twice the previous. So we can estimate 25,048 to be 26,000 because plus minus 1,000 when the number's 25,000 won't really make that much of a difference. And 26,000 is a nice number to divide by 13 because 26,000 divided by 13 gives 2,000. And so roughly he's been rowing for 2,000 miles per year. In the expression 1 box, 2 box, 3 box, 4, each box is to re be replaced by either plus or times. What is the largest value of all the expressions that can be obtained in this way? So intuitively, we would want to put a times in each box. We would think that would give us the greatest number. However, multiplying by 1 does not actually increase the number. So we can try 1 plus 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 4. And we see that that is 1 plus 24, which is 25. And it's the largest option, so we know we don't need to search for any other solution. So E is the letter. Anyways, thank you for watching. Part 2 should be out soon. And yeah, see you next time.